Tommy. Mm, yes, and you'll feel better. Think so? Mm-hmm. Okay, okay, I'll tell you the whole story. Granny, the next time somebody tells you that you can't beat fun at the old ballpark, don't you believe them? They're wrong, boy, are they wrong? <laughs> oh, Ben, come on, Ben, the magic door with me. everybody. Boy, it looks like Bully Beaver has really bitten off more than he can chew this time, doesn't it? Now, why do you suppose he's eating the largest tree in Friendly Forest? You know, I think he's telling the story to Granny right now, so if we hurry through the magic door, we can see for ourselves. But before we do, I would love to introduce you to our two Hebrew words for today. That's right, I said two, because, well, they both are very similar. <laughs> the first one is Yeled which is the word for boy. And Yelid looks like this with a Yud and a Lamed up here and a Dalid, Toda Yelid. And the other word is Yalda, which is the Hebrew word for girl. And it looks like this with a Yud, Lamed, and a Dalid, and a Hey, Toda Raba, Yelid, Vi, Yalda. Now, just as both of these words sound very similar in Hebrew, in Israel, both boys and girls are considered to be equal in every day, in every aspect of everyday life. Many jobs are done by boys as well as girls, and both boys and girls do join the army. See, it's a lane where there is no discrimination between males and females, and everyone is considered equal. Now, keep that in mind as we hear what happened to Booby last summer, because, well, it took him a while to realize that in our country, too, both boys and girls should be given the same chances in everything they do. Well, I think that Booby's just about to tell a story to Granny, so if we hurry through the magic door and you help me sing the song, we can catch it straight from the beaver's mouth. You ready? Here we go. Aleph, Bet, and the Gimel, Dalit, Real. Open magic door to Toraville. Aleph, Bet, and the Gimel, Dalit, Real. Open magic door to Toraville. Come on, let's go. Okay, team, let's get him show on the television station this evening. Oh, Benny, you're going to be on television. Uh, uh, but, Uncle Bo, who's going to tell Booby that I'm on the team? You just be at that TV studio before the game, and you leave the rest to me, you hear? WTVL, your station for sports in Toraville presents The On Deck Man, featuring interviews with the greatest names in sports and the lineup for today's championship baseball game between the Toraville White Locks and Chapel Town. And here is your host for The On Deck Man, Mr. Box Score himself, Max Mailbox. Thank you, Tiny, and welcome to today's game. My sidekick, Beauregard Beaver, has an interview for us, but before we get to that, we'll go over today's lineup. Oh, and speaking of lineups, Max, we've got some great pictures of some future stars that our friends from home and from all over the area have sent in to us. That's right, fans. Mm -hmm. Thank you for sending us all your pictures and letters. We've gotten so many, we're overflowing. See? Oh, I sure do. Well, let's take a look at those pictures now, okay? Here are just a few that came through the magic door. Hmm, this is Jay and Chris Ann Flanyak, six and eight years old from Wheaton. Here's nine-year-old Lori Espy from Chicago. Eight-and-a-half-year-old Carol Beckman is from Dyer, Indiana. Eight-year-old Don Britton batting cleanup is from Chesterton, Indiana. Vesna is ten and Zorica Metrovich from Hobart, Indiana. Well, here's Amy Schneider from Oglesby, Illinois. That's 12-year-old Cheryl Perry of Chicago. Eight-year-old Jenny Morgan is from Barrington. Gretchen Gronau, eight and a half from Lake Bluff. Here's Douglas Gladowski, who's ten from Hinsdale. That's Mary Middleton, nine years old from Roselle. Carla Jackson is from Chicago. Hi, Carla. Kim is five, Mickey's eleven, Michelle is nine. Their last name is Most, and they're from LaPorte, Indiana. Well, here's eleven-year-old Darty Chapel from Itasca. Christine Groves is from Oak Park. And here we have the Trutkovskis. Here's Stephanie, who's seven, and Jennifer, who's two, and they're from Gary, Indiana. Lisa Berkebile, five years old, from Northbrook. Here we have seven-year-old Lee Ostrander from Gurney. Hi, Lee. Karen Matsushima is six years mm -hmm. old, from Arlington Heights. And here we have the Wells. Here's Victor and Karen Wells, and they're from Hartford, Michigan. And don't forget to send your pictures to... 
a magic door. WBBM. TV. It's a magic door. WBBM. TV. Chicago, Illinois. Chicago, Illinois. 60611. And don't forget that zip codes are very important. That's right. Well, now that we've got the lineup all set, I think I'm going to go down to the field and find my seat. Good luck to us. Shalom. Thank you, Tiny. Now here's the White Locks lineup. Leading off and playing first base will be Rumpelmeyer Dragon. That long neck of his gives him a stretch. Of hmm. I think they do understand quite a lot about each other, after all. Open, come open the magic door with me. With your imagination, there's so much we can see. Open, come open the magic door with me. With your imagination, such happy times can be. There is a doorway that leads to a place. I find my way by the smile on your face. It's quite amazing, but true. There is a doorway that leads us to friends. Learning and laughing, the fun never ends. But it depends. All on you Open, come open The magic door with me With your imagination There's so much we can see Open, come open The magic door with me with your imagination, such happy times can be. Open, come open the magic door with me. With your imagination, such happy times can be. See, be, be, and see. Be, see, be, and see. Be, see, be, and see.